Hi, my name is Tiffany Denise Carper. I am 19 years old and I will be an upcoming sophomore here at Glenville State College next year. My goal for today is to give you a tour of most of these buildings that you're seeing right now and later on in this video I will tell you my own story of why I came here to Glenville State College. This first building that I'm showing you is the Lewis Bennett Hall or the LB building. This is where you'll take care of your financial aid and if you need help with your computer getting it fixed or anything like that you can talk with the computer technicians here. Okay so I just showed you the Lewis Bennett Hall building and if you go down these steps that I just zoomed in on and come down this path right here directly across you'll find another building and this for all of you biology, science, or math majors is where you'll be spending most of your time. This is the science hall building where all your math and science classes take place. Um, I came up here as a biology major because throughout high school biology was my favorite subject and I thought okay I can major in this but as I started taking some of the courses to become a biology major I realized that it wasn't for me so I started thinking about what I enjoyed doing and I previously had taught younger kids through um, once through a summer school program and I enjoyed it so I ended up changing my major to elementary education and science fifth through ninth so I still get my science in there. The building that I'm showing you now is the administration building which we just came from right over here the science hall building. That's the nice thing about Glenville State College is that you don't have to walk very far for your next class. You can walk it within five minutes. Here in the AB building you'll go to your English classes, your education, and your public speaking classes. When I first day at Glenville was very nerve-wracking. I didn't know where hardly anything at all was at, but um, that caused me to meet new people make new friends because I was forced to ask around and not be shy and just try to find stuff on my own but I actually had to interact with others and ask where things were at but besides that it was a pretty good first day. So here's the library and if you come down that set of steps right there and across the street you'll find the fine arts building and in this building You'll have your band classes, your music classes if you become a music major. And they don't have art as a major right now, but they still offer a whole lot of fun art classes where you can learn about the history of art. And you also have your basic art classes like watercoloring or where you get to work with clay, just stuff like that. But it's a pretty nice place and I myself spend a lot of time in this building. Um, being a first generation college student means a lot to myself because I know that I pushed myself further than anyone else in my family to be like to make something better of myself and to get a better, better education so I don't have to be stuck the rest of my life working at a job that I don't like working at all. I can do something that I enjoy. Um, to my family it means a lot. My dad, he made it to the ninth grade and dropped out of high school. And my mom, she became pregnant with me and she had to graduate a year early out of high school, so she didn't get to go to college. But my mom, she's trying to take college courses right now. And my dad, he's stuck with construction. He doesn't really enjoy doing that at all. But um, they support me 100% with going to college and they think that it's a great choice that I'm trying to further my education and better myself as a person. Right here you have your Pickens Hall which is where all of your dorm rooms are. Okay, so with my room, I have two beds that's provided, and you have three closets, which is another one right over here. Basically, you get a microwave in your room, and you have your little storage places right down through here, where you can keep all your food and everything like that. And, of course, I already told you, you have your two beds, and you get a desk, Right now mine's a little bit of a mess, but it's okay. You can also hang stuff on your walls. Right now I have some of my artwork and some different posters of all sort. And over here on this one I have 
even some family photos hanging up along with pictures that my little sister drew me. And I also have a really big birthday card that one of my friends made me for this year. I'd say one piece of advice that I'd give to someone coming up here as a college freshman from high school is that be yourself and don't let anybody change you whenever you come up here and don't let anyone pressure you and make sure you study.